we're going to start off with a circle now these circles you have to press really lightly on the page because you'll be rubbing these out afterwards now I have to go a little bit darker on my page so you guys can still see on the video but I'm pressing as light as I can just so that I can still rub it out afterwards so you start off with a circle like this I'll just check that you guys can see it you can so that's a basic circle and then you're going to draw some circles some mini circles that slightly overlap the big circle you're going to draw one here and you're going to draw one here and you're going to make sure that the space in between isn't too spacey and make sure the gap's not too too wide Okay, Oops. Ah. <laughs> so that's the basic principle there, and then you're going to draw the bridge of the nose, like so. I'm going out slightly here because that's where the eyes will start. So if you haven't already, I did a tutorial on how to draw eyes, and I'm planning to do another tutorial on how to do mouths, ears and then eventually I'll show you guys how to connect it all together to make a face okay so that's your basic guideline you're then going to start filling it in so I'm just going to use a slightly darker pencil now I'm going to use if I can find it I'm going to use a 2B uh, to be okay so now for the, the sketching in so I'm gonna start off sketching in the middle here like so and then I'm gonna go up slightly there the start of the nostrils and then we've got the outside nostrils here I'm sorry about the flashing my fairy lights have decided to stop working so that's why there's odd flashing so we've got the outside bridge of the nose here Now these circles are just guides, so, you know, they just help to start the shape together. Okay, so that's the bottom of your nose, I've drawn my lines in. I'm now going to use a rubber just to get rid of the outside circles because I don't really need them anymore. Now this is why you need to press lightly on your pencil when you draw the, these guidelines so that you know you don't you're not left with a big mark afterwards. Okay, so I'm just gonna go over with these again. bottom of my nose done now one thing that people do as a mistake when they start off drawing is when they start off drawing a nose whenever they draw a nose they do a really dark line here where the bridge of the nose is and then they'll do their nostrils sometimes a bit like this so this is what my noses used to look like before I learned how to draw them properly So in a realistic drawing you don't make those harsh lines when you're doing the bridge of the nose. It, it's gradually done through shading so I'm going to show you how to shade. 
So, oh, fairy lights are turned back on again. Okay, so I'm going to start off with going slightly dark here. And then I'll gradually go on to blend it all together. There's always a bit of shadow here. I'm going to draw, I'm going to just rub away that line there. shade over here now you can see already that the nose is really starting to come alive now just to create a bit of smudge and a bit of blending. Now you can use your finger. Sometimes I use a blending tool so that I've got a bit more control but I'm not going to use that today. Okay so now that I've blended a little bit I'm now going to just do a bit more building up. And you can see the difference how how nice and smooth this is compared to that and it gives that three-dimensional way of just making it stand out a lot more because that's basically what drawing is your your, your shading and making it stand out it's not all about harsh lines Sorry about some noise if you can hear it. There's some builders next door. That's the start of the cupid's bow underneath. Alright. I would say that that is my nose. So this is where the magic happens, so I use my rubber and I'm going to rub out to create some highlights. So I'm going to get my rubber and I'm going to use the edge and I'm going to create, I'm just going to rub a line down the middle and I'm going to rub a little bit in the corner here. Because that's where the natural light catches. Like so. So, this is how not to draw a nose, and this is how to draw a nose. So, again, it's just the basic start. 
and, and the more you practice the better you'll get so yeah have a go have a practice and if possible i'd love to see what you've done okay thank you